Scene one, take one. Give yourself time. Understand that it will take time. Reach out, obviously, to indigenous people, as many as you can. Don't assume that because you've talked to one indigenous person that you've now found all of the answers, because that is never the case. Reach out to as many as possible and continue to reflect on those things. Reflection is also an important piece of learning and how you're then gonna you know, take that reflection to put it into some practice, if it's in a classroom or whatever it may be, working with children and whatnot. It's a constant reflection. It's a constant renewal of what I thought I knew may not have been, and now I'm using my, my new learning to continue on this journey. This work is important and it takes a lot of time to build that community and to get all those resources. Um, but the important thing is, is that you just take the first step. Indigenous ways of knowing and teaching, a lot of that is related to land-based education, so learning from the land and with the land. And uh, an example of this, an experience I had was, I was working in a class as a substitute teacher and I took the students outside and we went for a walk to the park. There was no green space right around the school, so we had to walk a bit. And we looked for art and we made art with the things that we found in nature. So different elements, pine cones, leaves, flowers, things like that. And what this was able to do was really um, get students to appreciate the knowledge that they can they can gain from being on the land and being with the land. And they were also able to clearly care for the space that they were in and want to take care of their earth. Um, and that's something that's really important, especially nowadays. We need, we need people who want to care for the earth and indigenous peoples are the original and continue to be the primary caretakers of the entire planet. So my hope for everyone who's come to this Walking Alongside website today is that you feel that you can take that first step, whether that means you're going to try tomorrow in, in your classroom to introduce a new topic that's represented on this website, or if it means you just spend a little bit more time reflecting on your own positionality as you start to think about what this journey means to you. And I feel like no matter what happens, it's gonna be worth it and that you just have to get started.